in this video I will explain you how to install Windows OS Windows 10 in VirtualBox so it's a basic setup like uh, you have to click here like on a new machine write the name of your OS or whatever name you want to give to this particular virtual machine select the type and select the OS okay like type of the OS like Windows Linux Solaris and hit the continue button provide the RAM here I am going to provide here 2 gigabytes like it's a default value in my PC you can increase or decrease value as you want so 2 gigabyte is ok for me hit the continue button then create the virtual hard disk here create a virtual hard drive not the virtual disk image or not a virtual machine disk I would prefer to select the virtual hard disk so hit the continue button allocate size dynamically and uh, fixed so I am here going to select the dynamic allocator and hit the continue button here you can select the path to your virtual hard drive I am selecting my external hard drive here you can put your external hard drive uh, or you can select your internal hard drive save and then create the virtual hard drive and you, here your our basic setup is already finished and uh, start your virtual machine when you hit the start they will ask you to insert the ISO file of your OS so uh, I am going to install Windows 10 business edition open and start here you can see I already have installed two OS's Windows Server and Windows 10 and I am going to uh, right now I am installing another Windows 10 client so hit the next button continue install now and here our setup is started after finishing this setup you will see the our window will return normally here and uh, because it's a business edition they are going to ask me either one I want to install Windows Enterprise or Pro I will select the Windows 10 Enterprise edition if you have downloaded just the Windows 10 Home or the Windows 10 Pro then that window like previous on this window you never see, never see this window on your ISO image if you are installing home edition so you will see like this this window directly like accepting the license terms hit the next button and uh, custom OS and uh, here just as here you can see our virtual hard drive 50 gigabytes hit the next button and here our windows is installing that process you will see the basic uh, your startup screen so select the country and hit the yes it will take a little bit time okay so after installing if you think that your machine is running slow and you, you want to change the settings then you can change the settings like uh, by going in a setting menu and then you can change your name your system configuration like the provided RAM in my other machine I have provided the 4 gigabytes so here you can see the 4 gigabyte of RAM you can change it and if you can if you can see that uh, in your PC that uh, the number of processors are provided in 
by virtual machine you can increase or decrease as per your requirements here again select the keyboard type I'm skipping the tutorial on this window if you want to join your Microsoft account here then you can type your account ID and then password but uh, I'm going to apply the domain join option because I'm not syncing my data to cloud and I'm not going to add my Microsoft account here I'm just using this machine as a local host or just a local PC so I will provide here my name and then the password again so our windows is installed here searching for the display driver for the performance okay so here you can see the our windows is installed in virtual box and uh, you can see the our hardware like hard drive of the capacity capacity of our hard drive is you, you can see the 415 GB and available is 32 GB and that's it so this is how you install your Windows client OS in a virtual box in my next video I'm going to combine this virtual machine like the client one and the server one and make one network by using virtual box so subscribe my channel and if you like this video then give me a thumbs up and if you have any kind of query or questions feel free to comment thank you for watching